Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we are going to discuss about three things. Ubisoft is giving away free stuff, Callisto Protocol is in PUBG Universe, and Vin Diesel isn't just sharing an arc. He's also working on the game. So before jumping into the topic, please like the video, it helps a lot, and subscribe to our channel and click the bell button icon. Okay, let's get into the video. First one is Ubisoft is giving away free games and in-game stuff every day this week. Uh, it actually kicked off its Happy Holidays giveaway event today with Assassin's Creed Valhalla items. Before going further, please comment down if you have bought the game already or get to buy it in Xbox or PlayStation. Now getting into the topic, uh, to get the free stuff, you have... You have to go into the Ubisoft official website and just click register now. It is free to register. And also the free giveaway stuff comes in comes between eight days. Between seven to eight days. Uh, Ubisoft has also tweeted that uh, you can still claim the gift and you will be able to access when you have a copy of a game. So don't worry. You can... Uh, the, those who have not bought the game, just go and register and you can get it when you bought the game. Um, after registration, uh, the screen will show like this. So go and buy the game now. Okay, our second topic is Callisto Protocol. The survival horror game Callisto Protocol is set in PUBG universe. Uh, well, PUBG is a very silly multiplayer game and also uh, they they said in 2019 that we will give you a survival horror game the best in this generation and if it was a separate game um, then no problem but uh, it is a first uh, certain PUBG universe that seemed to be bothering me uh, here's what they said from what I hear it's hard to be creative and talk nicely about it but from what I hear Dead Space was one of the scarier games of its generation and I want to do the same on next gen and what's considered now the current gen, he said. We are trying to make you really free, feel like you are in this world even though it's you escaping from his prison, from this prison and you have got to survive these unthinkable horrors. Uh, well, the PUBG universe also always uh, had a zombie mode uh, like Call of Duty and other games but uh, Callisto Protocol and PUBG how that they can sync together I don't know please let you let me know your thoughts in the comments okay then now our final topic is that Vin Diesel is now the creative Convergence President of Pilecod and Executive Producer, producer of ARC 2. Uh, well, Vin Diesel's Fast and Furious 9 movie is delayed actually. And to <laughs> spend some time in the industry uh, rather than cinema, he, I think he actually came into the game industry. Or two, uh, he would have gone to a better one. Uh, Vin Diesel in movies is good, but in games, I don't know. Uh, Vin Diesel will be quick. Uh, Getting the bust. Uh, this is the tweet that was uh, tweeted by Arc Survival Evolved at Vin Diesel. Report this between Vin Diesel actually reported uh, a bug issue uh, that has been. Uh, uh, informed to him uh, and he will correct it soon um, so this is how we got the information and we'll see what the game is going to do 
Uh, he is a new creative director and producer of Act 2. The uh, Act 2 is actually a dino survival game. The extensive trailer is shown in the Game Awards 2020. And Many of us were surprised to see Vin Diesel in a game. Um, it turns out that the Fast and Furious series star isn't just lending his looks, voice, and motion capture dino slaying moves to Art 2. Diesel is actually working on the game itself. According to a press release sent to PC Gamer, Vin Diesel has joined Studio Wildcard as an executive producer of Art 2 and is also serving an executive producer on the ARC animated series coming in 2022. This dual role could explain his new title. Diesel is now Studio Wildcard's president of Creative Convergence. Well, that is one heck of a title and I also have to believe it's not just a title. Diesel is reportedly a long-time ARC player, having logged thousands of hours in the Dinosaur Survival game. He also likes that, I think so. He understands the game is intimately and is providing direct feedback to the development process, says Studio Wildcard. Heck, Diesel is already working hard at reporting bugs in ARC. Studio Wildcard hasn't announced a release date for ARC 2 uh, other than its year uh, that was coming in 2022, and we don't know exactly how Diesel's character, Santiago, who is described as a 24th century mech pilot, gearhead, and freedom fighter, will fit into the online multiplayer game. Uh, we will have to wait and see it. And that's all guys. Um, please let me know your thoughts in the comments. And uh, like the video, it really helps me to establish and grow the channel and make some awesome and uh, new, many contents for you. And Take care. I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.